ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play a Game. Today, we are taking a look at the game Dark Fracture. I do not know a damn thing about this game. I was searching for some games to play on Steam, and I saw that this was free. It had some pretty good reviews, so I figured, eh, screw it, let's check it out. Now, apparently, this is the prologue to the full game that'll be coming out sometime. I think the release date was somewhere in 2021. So, let's take a look and see what happens. New game. It's meant to be completed in a single session. If you quit mid-game, all progress will be lost. Sounds fair to me. Loading. All right. Oh, my cats are bothering me. They're being really fluffy. Aren't you adorable? Oh, here we go. The broken mind leaked his fractured soul into a dark, endless labyrinth. In the eternal night, he longed for respite from the loneliness, only to realize he had never really been alone. Mind blown! Alright. Oh, look. Papers. Pencils. Boring shit. <sighs> Yawn. Are those Almost drugs. Out. Oh. I need a cigarette. You need a cigar. Where's my damn lighter? Did you check your pockets? That is a slow open. Oh look. I smoke a pack of Jesus Christ. Dude, maybe you should cut down on the smoking. Oh, tab to close. Why is it tab? Whatever. That's only the top ones are openable. Alright, let's see if we can find his lighter. Throw. That wasn't a throw. Alright, so I don't think the throw function works. Either that or it's just misleading. You pop a pill? No. Turn on some music. Right, where the bloody hell's the lighter? Some keys. Nothing useful. At least by the looks of things. Oh, look! A picture of a baby! Still no lighter. More drugs. Alright. Yeah, that's not creepy. Let's keep that on. Oh, yeah, it's locked. Where'd I leave the key? Oh, boy. I just had the damn thing. Come on. Uh, did. Thank you, okay. That's the office key. Where's my lighter? Okay. Cool, got it. Do I still get a. Alright, I'm turning this off. Can we check your coat? No? should turn the lights on. Yeah, no kidding. The hell am I a doctor? What? Oh, cool. Well, the light didn't pop, so that's a good sign. Well, it didn't pop yet. Where could I have left my lighter? Like how there's just a desk here. Is the lighter here? Oh, we have another key. Never know what that could be used for. My locker key. I'm gonna slide it in on my office keychain. Don't need 
you. What about these drawers? Anything? Nope. Nothing in there. Alright. I don't care. Let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Close these so they're out of my way. Which locker could be mine? My god, all these lockers are filthy! Oh, there we go. Uh, home sweet home. And there's the lighter. Well, kind of. Cool. Oh crap, I almost forgot about the pill. They are watching. Who's watching? We better take this thing. Well, I better do it the way they asked. Because with all these cameras around, it feels like they're watching my every move. How the hell do they want you to take the damn pill? Just pop it in your mouth and you'll be fine. Oh, God. Edward, by the time you read this, I would no longer be in your life. I have changed my phone number, taken my belongings, and will be staying in a hotel for a short while. I left your keys on the desk. I won't be needing them anymore. I just cannot watch you do this. I loved you, Edward. I still love you, and that is exactly why I can't stomach seeing this. Press E to continue reading. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, I cannot help you if you fight me at every turn, and I won't stand by while you destroy yourself, destroy us. I know I'm being selfish, I know this must hurt, but I'm hurting too, and no matter how many times we spoke, my words never reached you. I am sorry it has to be this way, but I know that if I tried saying goodbye in person, I would change my mind. So before that happens, I'm leaving. See ya. Alright, well, cool. I want a vent full. Dismiss. Oh wait, take? Sure, why not? Well, the showers don't work. Ugh. Faculty medication. The administration here requires all safety, all staff to consume this pill daily with strange specific directions. They calmly. They claim the village for staying mentally alert on the job. Um, daily ritual. What the? In front of a mirror in the men's bathroom. Where the hell's the bathroom? There's the women's bathroom, here's the men's bathroom. Many random paranormal events will occur throughout Dark Fracture. Your sanity will be strained by such events. Your actions will also affect your sanity. Try to preserve it to get through the game. Push it too low, and you may not make it. Cool. Okay. Got this over there. We finally head to the storeroom for a smoke. Is that blood or shit? Oh, good god. Never mind. We're gonna leave that alone. What room? Oh, fuck it. Let's just go. Put this away. Nope. You know, you don't need to put that at every portion. I'm just waiting for a few of these lights to give out. Ooh, what do we have here? Ah, uh, here's the smoking section. Wait. Where the hell are my cigarettes? God damn it. Seriously? I left the cigarettes behind in the office? What is this? Weird valve handle. I don't remember it ever being here. Oh, 
Cool. Locked myself in. Cool. Jesus Christ! Well... And it begins. Is that a dude with no flesh? Just peeks his head around the corner, hello! Probably an important call. Was that chair here before? Shit. Missed the call. I should probably get back to work. Well, let's not forget your cigarettes. Never mind, you couldn't take them to begin with. Alright, cool. Back to work. Wait a minute. What the hell is even your job? I better get busy. For what I recall, there are six bodies occupying the freezers in the freeze room. The team checkup is in order. I still got a few more hours to spend down here until my shift ends. But when I'm done, I should also check on the decomposition. All right. Well, so we do work in a morgue. Where the hell's the freezer room? Still not that one. work here what the fuck you couldn't pay me enough to work here oh good now there's some weird noises happening Where the hell is this freezer room? I need to find the freezer room. Alright, someone's fucking with me. I am probably not gonna survive this. Nope. I used up all my lighter fluid, didn't I? to move both trolleys out of the room before opening the freezers. <sighs> okay, now for the second trolley. Okay, we can drop it. All right, there we go. Is there a light? Ah, here we go. Just you, so we can slip you right through the door. This is done. I can go check the occupied freezers. Right. Which ones are occupied? Not you. Oh, you're occupied. Six bodies in total. What? Fucking hell. Body is missing from the freezer. Fuck. Better use the office phone to report this immediately. That light is just asking to go out. What is this, the elevator? Yep. Hello? 
Of course. Dude, this is the part where you just leave. Shutter clicking away, but where's it coming from? Hey. Who's there? What in the world? This body should be here. This is messed up. Dude, clearly somebody's fucking with you. Alright, let's take that. Press 2 to equip or unequip your camera. Use as an unlimited source of light. Hmm. Well, now what? What in the seven? And where the bloody hell is the storeroom? Oh, cool. The shutter's getting weird sounds now. Well, these weren't here last time. Oh! Well, don't you look friendly. Ew. Get back. Uh-oh. Yeah, let's just keep walking towards the big ugly monster. Fuck. I sure as shit hope so. Alright, the hallway's back to normal. Fuse box, where art thou? lights are working now. I should locate my medication quickly. I guess that's it. Oh boy. Ooh, double flash. Oh, you could peek. Losing his mind. This isn't happening. Keep it together. You can get through this. This isn't real. Flying 
hell is the medication? What the fuck is this? Alright. around, they don't provide much illumination in small parts of the facility, but it's better than nothing. Now that I can at least see where I'm going instead of groping around in the darkness, this is a good chance to go and grab my medication. It is kept on the cabinet in the office. Oh, wait. I don't need you. I believe this is it. back up to almost full sanity. Now what? Strange things will stop happening, but I've got a creepy feeling in my gut that this man is here to stay for the night, so I'm screwed. That's good to know. Now what the hell do we do? What in the seven? Let's just close this door. Wait it out. in my locker. And I believe I already grabbed it. Did I not grab it? Why do I get the feeling that's not going to be as easy as I think it is? Come on. Not too far from the door. Oh wait, that's right, it's here. Time to get the hell out of Dodge. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. All these chains and locks weren't here before. And the door handle. It's just gone! <sighs> oh boy. Not good. Fucked. That's what's going on here.
caused the walls to crumble. Is it used for anything? Looks like some sort of handle could fit here. I think I have an idea. Wonder if that valve is still back there. Back into the storage room we go. God damn it. did that just do? When I open this door, what's going to be on the other side? Yep. This is such a terrible idea. You're not wrong. Get to the light. It's all you need to do. To start moving. This must be a nightmare. What the hell is going on? It's a one hell of a nightmare. Oh boy, all right. And the character's losing his mind. Together, man. No! Somebody help me! Oh boy. No. 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 And game over. Uh, Thirty minutes, not too bad. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was the Dark Fracture Prologue. Thank you for joining me for this wonderful adventure. I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play a Game. Take care and have a good one.